Hello, this is Paul Matthews. This is tutorial eight on Twilio. This tutorial is about receiving SMS and responding to it. The prerequisite of this tutorial is the first tutorial, which includes the basic setup that includes exam and uh, also ngrok. In this tutorial, we will cover receiving the SMS and then we will cover responding to the SMS. So let's take a look at Twilio SMS. Here is Twilio SMS. And there we can see the verbs within Twilio SMS. It's quite simple. Uh, there are uh, only two verbs. One is the message verb and the other one is the redirect verb. So let's take a look at the message verb. And let's pick an example. This is the code that will respond to an SMS. So let's copy and paste this code. Use our text editor and save this file. I'm going to name this as sms.xml and we are going to change this response instead of having this message as the response we are going to say nice to meet you let's save the file let's go back to ngrok copy this url and try this URL within a web browser. Checks out, there is a small XML that says what the response is. Now we'll copy and paste. Now, instead of pasting this as a web hook, for voice calls, we're going to scroll a bit below and then have the webhook for messaging and paste it here. So when a call is made to this number, it is this webhook, which was our previous tutorial. It's that webhook that will be called. However, when Twilio receives a message, it's this webhook that's called, and these two webhooks can be different, and in most cases, it will be different. So let's save that file, and instead of calling, let's now send an SMS to that number. Again, the number to send SMS is 408 478 I'm going to send hello. And I got a response saying, nice to meet you. Let's uh, expand on this just a little bit. And let's see if uh, we can add two messages. We'll type in a 
and we got a response saying what is your name let's look at the message logs This is the first response. The message was nice to meet you. We see some interesting data with this message. We know that this is when the message was created, this is when the message was queued, and this is when the message was delivered. Let's look at the next message. And here we see that the message was not delivered. And there was an error. So we created the message, we queued it, we tried to send it, and there was an error. So we know that this message was not delivered. It's an unknown error. So we're not quite sure what happened, but we know that this message did not get delivered. This is the second message that we sent out. It is what's your name and we know that that got delivered this uh, delivery status uh, is is very useful because that tells you whether the message was delivered or not if we look at the message log and hover over the messages we can see the message that uh, that was sent out and also the the responses that does complete this tutorial uh, this was a basic introduction to twilio messaging uh, we we learned how to uh, receive the message and we learned how to respond to the message i hope this was useful we'll have more detailed